YouTube, what's up, man? Fly, Eagles, fly. Flooded the Giants. Where are the Giants fans at? Danny Dimes, Dexter Lawrence, he's Mean Joe Green, Kayvon Thibodeau is Lawrence Taylor. Giants fans, what? I mean, what happened? Absolutely demolished that team. Embarrassed the coach of the year. That team was not prepared for the Eagles. That was the most un uncompetitive playoff game I've ever watched. What the Eagles did to the Giants. It was over. It was cooked. It was cooked before the first quarter was over. The Eagles look back to being high-powered. Look to be the best team in the playoffs right now, without a doubt. I know some of you are saying, relax, it's the Giants, it's the Giants. Well, they were they were hot. Apparently, it was 2007 again. Isn't that what you guys said? It's 2007 again. Danny Dimes is, is he's moving up to that elite echelon. What we saw was elite from the Philadelphia Eagles. We move on to the NFC Championship game. I will be in Philly. We'll be going to the game Sunday, 3 p.m. We're playing Brock Purdy and the Niners. Who do you guys like? Niners are cracked. They're tough. They're really good. Um, I think the rosters are pretty even. I really do. The biggest advantage the, the Eagles have, quarterback. They got Jalen Hurts, MVP candidate. Probably going to be second to MVP to Pat Mahomes. They got Brock Purdy, Mr. Irrelevant, seventh round pick, seven games started. I mean, he's done really well. I have nothing bad to say about Brock Purdy. He's been balling. He's been doing his thing. Still a little, uh, he doesn't have to do much. Get the ball out there to Debo, to uh, Christian McCaffrey, get it to Kittle. They got a lot of horses over there. Great online, great running game, good offensive coach. So it's going to be tough to stop. I mean, at the end of the day, the biggest advantage the Eagles have, there's two big advantages. Quarterback, got to agree on that. And then... At the end of the day, home field advantage. San Francisco has to fly 3,000 miles to the other side of the country. Those are two huge advantages. So for me, got to go birds. Birds by double digits. Easy claps. Go into the Super Bowl. Can't wait. Love to see it. This is the Eagles theme team. And because the Eagles are doing so well, we keep getting cards. I can't lie. This Eagles theme team is cracked. Look at what I'm rocking right now. We got Randall Cunningham, the man, the myth, the legend. Pass lead elite. Fearless gunslinger. He's actually cracked. Keith Byers. We got AJ Brown, Devontae Smith, and we're actually going to use Zach Ertz and Dallas Goddard. Two tight end system. Both have short end, and Zach Ertz has red zone threat. Devontae Smith has short end and slot apprentice. And AJ Brown has route tech and red zone threat. Jordan Malata has edge protector. Once I get Lane Johnson, they get a new Lane Johnson with like one AP edge. I'll put him on. I'll put that out there, but they don't have one. So I'm missing an edge edge threat, edge threat, protector. So if I run into an edge threat or a double or nothing, I might have some trouble. But we'll be able to double team and slide and pray for the most part. But that's the offense I'm rocking. You guys know I'm rocking the New Orleans Saints ebook. That link is below. You guys got to check it out. Um, it will be updated this week. Tons of new plays I've been running. And if you guys have been watching MCS, tight offset is kind of meta. A lot of plays that I've been running all year are really starting to become Super comp now, if you guys have been paying attention, tight offset is probably the number one used offense in Madden 23. I would, I mean, I would put that out there. Uh, and, you know, I, I've definitely come up with a lot of schemes from it, a lot of plays, a lot of route combinations. And this is the defense. We're going to rock man coverage. Don't have the best players for man coverage, but we're going to make it shake. We're going to put CJ Gardner Johnson in the outside corner with deep knockout and pick artists, Rasul Douglas. Also outside corner, deep knockout and pick artist, but he's a zone archetype, so it cost me five AP on him, I believe. So just a lot. A lot of AP on players where, you know, with the God Squad, you can get somebody to do that for one AP. So definitely tougher. And we have Harold Carmichael corner with just medium knockout and no pick artist. And Brian Dawkins, this is the new card right here. Boom. Insane. 98 speed. 98 zone 93 man coverage i have the some ball hawk thing to get boost i don't you guys know what i'm talking about the little strategy cards and we're going to put deep knockout on him and pick artists that's a total of two ap i want to say yeah and then the newest limited as we keep getting great cards javon hargrave 11 sacks pro bowl snub all pro snub Right there, you see him, Javon Hargrave, 97 block shed, 90 speed, 95 finesse, 90 power, 97 block shed, absolute stud. He's one of the reasons the Eagles defense is really tough, Javon Hargrave. And what we're going to put on him, we actually have his X Factor, which is called Relentless. 
and it gives him defensive down what is it rush moves no longer cost points so he doesn't have to care about points when he does his rush attack so he's non-stopping like non-stopping swim moving bull rushing so we'll see if it's good and he's got secure tackler for zero so he might be crap he might be tough he might be weak we'll see but like i said when you got a theme team and you don't have any of the cheap abilities you got to make it shake this is just, this car is cj gardner johnson the outside corner 97 speed 97 man this card is actually cracked uh, and deep knockout and pick artist. So we'll see what he does. This is the Eagles theme team, New Orleans playbook on offense. And we have the four, six playbook on defense boys tune in. I might want to start running when the springtime comes and man start dying down, run more theme teams. What theme teams are you guys rocking? Are you guys staying with legends? Are you mixing it up? I do feel like some of these could kind of be comp. Especially if you mix in some of the legends, like if you don't have just a strict theme team, because I mean having 97, 98 speed wide receivers like the Eagles theme team does, I mean that that's definitely a big deal. And really fast corners, you see 97 speed CJ, 98 speed Dawkins, that's fast. And I'm assuming we're gonna get a new Bradbury card here soon or a new Slay. That's gonna make the Eagles theme team actually super tough. So it's getting to the point where some of them might be comp, especially if we get some ability discounts. But we'll see. This game was in my Super Bowl. Let's see how this team does, boys. I appreciate the YouTube love. We crushed 40,000 subs. The road to 50K starts now. Super Bowl? The Eagles showing up to a Super Bowl. Let's go, boys. Yeah, the Eagles got to stop all the rinky dink. They got to be prepared to play the Niners. The Niners do a lot of... The Niners are scumbags. They want to audible flip motion reverse right audible flip motion this guy play action they want to they want to steal yards and then they steal yards with good players so it makes it so much better so much tougher like they're running a play action to get a tight end open but not only is it a tight end now it's kittle so he's fast and big as hell and hard to tackle yo the way y'all hating on jalen hurts is crazy i feel like everybody that likes sports for hurts It's the franchise he played for. So that I mean like you just gotta be a hater. Yo, you on the Eagles, I gotta hate. Is that how it works? Like, am I supposed to hate uh Dak? Look at Earth getting up out of there in the bowl early. I don't hate Dak. First of all, the Eagles don't have two white safeties, okay? They got one. His name is Reed, so he might be super white. Reed, Reed Blankenship. Bro, he's been tough. He's been low key like solid. -ish. My man Reed. Epps is not white. He's black or he's like he's like a CP2 combo. He's a combo coverage. Epps is combo coverage. Good work, good work, good work, good work. All right, this is RPO. I don't know how to stop it though. So, like, what do I do? Like, how do I, like, I, it's dead. It's like, what am I supposed to do? I pass committed, I didn't press. Like, how do I stop? Like, I hate this shit is just dumb as f I didn't press, I pass committed, he just snapped and that dude's just wide open. Cause they're like, a, like such a cool game, man. Love playing it. I don't want to run cover three. So literally I can't play man coverage is what you're telling me. I know I can run cover three, so I can't play man coverage. So, because he can run RPO, snap, throw to flat, I can't run man coverage. Nice, man. So awesome. Awesome game. User to DB and pick it. I should, shouldn't I? That would be something a Lord would do. Nice pick, bro. I mean, what's crazy is like, they didn't even make a hot route. He's just like, I'm going. I'm out of here. See you later. Easy collapse, two men under. Swear to God, I bet, I bet my top dollar. God, I just, I got the reads, bro. I mean, who is that Hercules? Oh my God. Dog, what the fuck is going on, man? Like, why, like, I seriously, man. 
Scotty, feet. Let's go, man. Come on, let's go. Run, Devontae. All right, all we gotta do is start stop an RPO and we win. Ooh, good tackle, Aguilar. Good run, bro. Way to get them six. Nice job. Should I be using our employer? Is he like fast? Is he good at anything? I mean, Carmichael. Are we like, are, are we serious, kid? Hey, Alabama, Alabama. Pick. Oh my god. Yo, where is Hargrave's big ass? There you go, Hargraves. Let's go on the run. Let's go. 30 and 8. 30 and 8. Be great. 30 and 8. Gun deuce. I got an audible. Chat told me. Dog! Dude, why, do I, why do I just like put myself through this life? Dog. RPO. It's just so much fun, man, and it's so much fun. Yo, dudes would rob their mother to win a Madden game. They really would rob their mother to win a Madden game. Yo, I got a third and ten. Yeah, let me just run RPO, snap and throw it. I'm not going to look at you. I'm just going to snap and throw it. Can we get a stop? Can we get off the field? What do you know? What do you say, boys? What do you know? What do you say? Thank God he threw to that guy, huh? Bro, I, if I could just, if I just know like what defense to run to stop the RPO, we get a dub here. Dawkins, let's go, man, dummy. Five seconds left, I have a gold kicker. Well, I just wanna let you guys know if you're new here, this is where I make plays. If you're new to the channel, new to the stream, new to pretty much everything, this is where we change the game here. I lied, go get it. Boy, ha ha! That's why you have buyers at running back. Six foe, pro tip right here. Listen, when they run three deep, who are they going to use her? The linebacker, right? They don't want to mess up the deep safeties. So if you put your running back on a wheel route, hopefully he doesn't run with them, and then you can get a one-on-one -on -one with the safety, right? That's what we got. We got a one-on-one -on -one with the safety. Because in all honesty, you're not going to throw a bomb on three deep. You're not going to. Make them use her somebody else, you know? Second good. Boom. I wish the running back was the same damn icon for every formation, dude. I swear to God. Oh, you don't like that, Reggie White. Mmm, fourth and six for your boy. Oh, he's not going to the RPO? Thank God. Oh, yeah, Dawkins locking down again. Dawkins locking down again. We will get a free touchdown to Zach Ertz right here. Told you. Ooh, I'm just a man of, I'm just a man of genius. Real man of genius. I mean, I know the RPO is really not like a glitch, but I just feel like if I have a man on that guy and I pass commit, he should guard him. That's all. That's why I feel like it's a, it's a glitch. It's glitchy. Dang, whip route was wide open. I mean, he really just no huddled, or he really just hit me with a... RPO glitch. Let's go, Dawkins. Boy, fourth and 20. No huddle. Come on. Oh, he's got everybody. Oh, but Javon Curse gets him. He is on tilt, as the kids say in the streets. He is indeed on tilt. That's what happens sometimes. Hurts. Now, this is where my conscience comes in as I'm a professional Madden player and streamer. You know, this guy's just out here balling. I, I really be wanting to quit and give him his Super Bowl because I'm a good guy. And I thoroughly beat his ass. So, like, I don't have anything to prove to myself, you know. 
Like, what do I have to prove to myself, right? Bro, why is it him, bro? Why is it him? Why? Like, he's getting railed. You know, well, he quit. There it is. Oh, heart. I mean, he was, he, he did show a lot of heart because he was, he was, he was down bad for a while. Like, he was down bad for a while, honestly.